Hi everybody, Diana here at Build a Quilt. Listen, I wanted to come to you today and share with you that I am prepping for tomorrow night's Wednesday Workshop Live. If you haven't met with us before, we always meet here at Build a Quilt on the YouTube channel at 6 p.m. Central Standard Time. And tomorrow night, we're making the Friendship Braid. But before I show you some of that, Look at my new table, you guys. I found this at Home Depot. It's called Husky. I believe it is part of their garage furniture, I guess you could say. It. Guys can have furniture in the garage or ladies. Um, and so I think it's part of that collection. It's got this super great hardwood top. And it's super sturdy on the bottom, and it's on caster, so it rolls. It's super heavy. So my dream machine I have on it right now, and it... It just works beautifully. I've never had a table for my machine that was this great. And one of the things I love about it is, look, there are two smooth rolling drawers. Now, you know, as Build-A-Quilters, we use our wash-away stabilizer. And since I like to use pre-cuts, I have a stack right here. And then I'm just keeping right now a couple of my longer rulers in here and just a few things. And then here's the screwdriver for my hoop. And tomorrow night, I'll tell you about the ordeal I've been having with my hoops. I ended up with two of them today that um, are now technically broken. So we'll talk more about that tomorrow night. But in the, the top drawer, that will all be filled eventually, I'm sure. But right now, I have I took a little tin. It was, I think, a Lori Holt tin. Let's see here. Move these two things out and show you the lid. Yeah, it says "Be Happy" on it. I'm sure this was part of a Lori Holt collection or a Lori Holt trinket or something. Um, but I have the lid right here. I have my scissors, my snips and my um, fabric tape. And then in this one, I have all the other little things, screwdrivers and my um, um, machine cleaning ones that you can find at our um, website, uh, www.mybuildaquilt.com. They are the silicone ones. Um, we've had these out for a while now, for a few years, um, and they work great. You get two of them. You can see I use mine. They're kind of dirty but the nice thing is you can run them underwater and clean them and then um, eventually I'll probably have some other things in here as well but that's what I have in here now I've got space right here I can keep my um, glue stick here if I need to I can leave my scissors here but I'm prepping for Wednesday workshop live so you can see I've got two um uh um hexagons I almost forgot um, in the process there and I've already made a few and I have a few more but last week I introduced you to the hexagon the build a quilt way and so we'll be using the hexagon um, pattern that I introduced last week to create our friendship braid block tomorrow night at workshop so if you haven't um, already picked that up go ahead and head over to the website and it should be one of the first couple of things you see there um, it is one of our segment singles so it is just four dollars and fifty cents you get the digital pro um, um, information or files and you get all the written information and you get it in this format to make the solid but you also get it as a bonus in the mosaic um, format as well um, and I showed you that last week I'll show it again tomorrow night and I am making 12 of the half hexes to get started with my braid so if you want to catch up and do a little bit of um pre-planning for tomorrow night so that you can work along with me. Um, if you can get 12 of these whipped up, they don't take any time at all, um, literally less than a minute to create each half, and you don't have to sew them together, you just need the half segments, then um, I think you'll enjoy tomorrow night's Wednesday workshop even more. Until then, everybody, go and, of course, quilt life beautiful.